So throughout World War II, there was one German tank that would cause fear throughout the ranks of the Allied soldiers more than any other. That was the Tiger tank. So this Tiger behind me here was part of the 102nd SS Heavy Panzer Battalion. This tank itself, number 224, commanded by Unterscharfuhrer Reisk, was on the 20th of August trying to make its way through the Moutiers along with a series of other German armoured vehicles when it suffered from a mechanical failure. Loss of oil pressure caused the tank to break down and realizing the situation was hopeless given the horrific losses suffered on the retreat from Mortain and then the trying to break out of the Falaise pocket. Unterscharfuhrer Reisk determined the best course of action would be to try and disable the tank to prevent it being used by or falling into the Allied hands. Charges were placed in the tank, they blew, it disabled the turret and uh, then it was just abandoned by them and they made their way back toward friendly lines. So at the time the Canadians just bulldozed it off the road to get it out of the way and then in the 70s the tank was bought by the town and is now on the side of the road. Unfortunately uh, somebody had the great idea to put this rather sad looking uh, green fence around it uh, which means you can no longer really gain proper access to it and the tank itself I think looks fairly sad as a result. One debate that often rages especially on the internet is of the effectiveness of this tank. Yes mechanically it had issues uh, having to switch out tracks to move it via road and rail. It was exceptionally heavy over-engineered however all of those logistical and operational arguments aside what was the one tank that had every allied soldier quake in his boots and rightly so it was the tiger why is it that most reports of enemy armor sightings especially from uh, Normandy onwards soldiers state they saw tiger tanks whether they were Panthers, uh, Panzer Mark IVs, or indeed Tiger tanks themselves, this one tank was the one that had the ability to strike fear and terror into every Allied soldier. And so from my personal point of view, this is why I personally believe this tank was one of the most effective that the Germans ever produced, purely for the fear factor and nothing else. So if you've enjoyed this short video on Tiger 224 and want to see more World War II Wayfinder content, don't forget to tap that uh, bell, like, comment and subscribe. It's always really appreciated. Okay, see you in the next one.